thirsty fella over here. Good morning. Hi, Bubba. Last night he did well again. He went to bed and then he didn't wake me up till 7 a.m. Yesterday was 6 a.m. So he's sleeping through the night. Good boy. We're gonna go potty now because as soon as he drinks, he pees. Good old buddy. Look how cute he is. He literally looks like there's like a bunny rabbit in the yard. He's so cute and little. Alright, he's gonna chill with me while I edit Vlogmas. My Wi-Fi here is so clean. It's like eh. And so my amazing editor was like ready for me, but my clips, I started uploading them to her yesterday and they still hadn't sent. So I'm just gonna edit them. That's all good, I got a little, a little buddy here. Let's do it. So we're currently <laughs> getting his chart done, his horoscope. He's a Libra. <laughs> and what's his moon and rising? Or what's his moon? I heard a Virgo in there. His Venus is in Virgo. Venus is in Virgo. That's love, right? And then, so what's his moon? She says his sun, moon, and Libra. Oh, well, we don't know his moon. Maybe his moon's in Libra, too. <laughs> don't He's like... <laughs> He's like a pop. Mm, the best green juice in the world. Happy Vlogmas Day 21. <laughs> I never introed the vlog today. I'm sitting here with Freddie. How we all doing? How we all doing? And just been having a lazy morning, just chilling with the pup. And we just booked his vet appointments. We're taking him to the vet later today just to make sure he's all good. And then in a couple weeks, he's going to get more vaccinations. He's already gotten a lot, but. Um, he has to like get more. Um, I'm in like a weird mood right now and apparently because today is December 21st and I've been seeing all this stuff about, you know, today's winter solstice, so lots of energy shifting and stuff like that, whatever you believe in. But they said today is a really good day to write down your manifestations, set intentions, and also release things. Like there's any crap in you and certain things you just don't want to think about or whatever, or just want to release, write them down. So I think I'm actually going to do that because I feel like that would be really good practice. I already did my doing well daily this morning. I wrote down. Uh, my affirmations for the day and everything like that, but I think that is something I need to do. I'm drinking a green juice because they always make me feel good. And our final grades just came out at 12, and I just checked, and we had a great semester, y'all. I'm so happy, except one of my classes isn't on there yet. But yes, yeah, so that's great news. And I've showed the pup so much. We are all ready to name the dog, except for Freddie. I'm tired of just, I just want to call him something. Time to work out. All right, you guys. So for whatever reason, like I was saying, I just feel like anxious, just kind of, I don't know. I couldn't tell you why. I think there's just, you know, having a new puppy in the house, it's like, it's changed. And I think we are still kind of like thinking about Miley a little bit, but then like, I love him so much and I know I'm just going to love him even more and then it's just like i don't know it's like such an i think we're just so overwhelmed with like how exciting this is and he's just been the best um but it's definitely like you know a change and then i'm thinking about how it is like the end of the year and um how i could not look paler in this lighting um you know like today's winter solstice there's lots to think about lots of manifestations for the new year you know kind of reflecting back on this year it was a harder year for me, um, but I grew a lot from it. I learned a lot from it, and I have to, you know, be so thankful for that. Um, but yeah, I think I'm just like having a lot of emotions right now. Um, all very good emotions, but it's almost like, whoa, so many emotions. Uh, so I'm just so thankful that I get to be home with my family for the holidays and have our new puppy. And I'm very thankful that I have this bike here to just kind of, you know, ride away my, my emotions. Sometimes I just like need to get moving a little bit. I thought about going for an actual bike ride, but 
for some reason, I'm really wanting to hop on the Peloton. A lot of people ask me like, oh, what's your Peloton at or anything like that. I am gonna be honest, I don't do a lot of the Peloton classes. I did in the beginning, but I just prefer to kind of do my own routines and play my own music and just kind of like feel it out because I find with the Peloton classes, there's not as much choreo that like I do it per velo. It's more of like, you know, there's a lot more to it, which is why I enjoy it. It's like literally dancing on a bike. So what I'll do usually is pop on the speaker and play some music and just kind of get after it. So I have this playlist on Spotify called Recently. I've been listening to it a lot. All my homemates are texting me, what's your dog's name? They're all like Finley, it needs to be Finley. I love Finley. All right, I'm just gonna play this song to kind of warm up called Batter Up by Mike. Right, that was a great workout. I haven't done arms in a hot minute because it's always like part of a spin class and I just like haven't done it. Um, and my arms are definitely a little shaky right now, but that was good. I definitely feel better. A nice shower will do the trick as well. Um, Freddie's watching the pup right now. And yeah, that was really nice. I had a lot of fun doing that. Dad just came here and brought this and said, I can't open it till Christmas Eve. I'm so curious. Oh, oh. All right, here is a little OOTD experimenting with some new outfit ideas. Um, so I'm just wearing this short sleeve t-shirt dress from ASOS. Um, super comfortable. It's a little long on me. So I found this belt in my closet here. I think it's from Princess Polly and it just kind of cinches it in and brings it up a little bit. These layer necklaces. This is from It's Especially Lucky on Instagram. It's like a little lock. This necklace is from Gold Hour Co. I just put my hair up in a ponytail. Same earrings. And then I popped over this blazer that I got like a month ago. And it has an attached hood and it's from Misguided. I just think it's so fun. It's like a little chilly out. And then I've got my boots on from ASOS. Woo! With the daddy -o. Hi girls. Oh, you haven't actually done that in a while. We are doing some Christmas elf errands. Um, but first, what do we do? We're gonna go do ginger shots. Woo! <laughs> oh my god, these are so pretty. All right, we just took our ginger shots. Woo! Those from that juicery are just like the best. Like when they make them fresh right in front of you, it just hits different keeping our guts healthy, our immune systems up, like all the things. And I already drank a juice this morning, but he was getting a juice, so I got one. This is apple, kale, parsley, spinach, celery, cucumber, lemon, and ginger. And his, you get the all in, right? All in. So he, it's like all vegetables, no fruit. All gas, no breaks. Kale, spinach, celery, cucumber, parsley, cilantro. Cilantro, is that how you say cilantro? Lemon, ginger, and turmeric. Yummo. I think it says remain. Mm. Yeah, it does. Cheers. Cheers. Woo! Mmm. Mmm. Ginger or green juices are just. Whew. I don't understand why people don't like them, especially if you get ones with fruit in it. I don't love the all green ones, but. Anyways, um. So right now we're running some errands. Uh. I've been on the hunt, mom. Stop watching right now. I feel like she's not watching, but stop watching. Um. You can't be watching my vlogs either anymore, by the way. Okay, well, you should speed through them. Oh, you speed through them, do you? Um, well, there's just lots of gifts in these things. So, my mom wants a pair of Ugg slippers, and she really doesn't even want the platform ones. She wants just, like, the typical, like, Ugg slippers with the toes covered and everything, and they are sold out everywhere. They're, like, such a big gift this year because I tried to get them yesterday, but I feel like we're going to try one more store and see if they have them there. If not, like, I'll order for them, them for her online and, like, print out a picture and be like... It's coming because I just don't really feel like online shopping at this point because it's so close to Christmas and the, the mailmen are already like grinding it out. Every time I see a mailman, I'm like, thank you. Like, I feel like they're just like 
they're warriors this year. Um, so yeah, we're gonna run in, see if they have some slippers. I need to go to Dick's Sporting Goods and get some things, but some of those things involve my father, so we're gonna have to figure out a way. You can like go to another side of the store or something. And for Freddy, um, I was gonna maybe get him like a golf shirt or something, because he's been like golfing. I don't know, or just like a cool fishing thing. And Santa Claus got him a golf shirt. Santa Claus got him a golf shirt, okay. To know my mom also wants a new swell bottle. Don't you have a Magnum? You can just give me one. I, I know, but she wants no, I have Hydro Flask. She's still on the swell. Those are the narrower ones, and then I drink the big Hydro Flasks. So I don't really know how that's gonna go, but we're gonna see if that maybe they have those at Dick Sporting Goods. I don't really know. So yeah, that's what's going on. Woo! This is the best Christmas song. The Christmas song. Also, Delaney just texted me and said, I feel like you. I'm having myself a day. Just got an Irish cream cold brew and now I'm Christmas shopping. I love it. Found some swell bottles. I love this color. This is a light blue. It's very peaceful, Michelle. Love that. We've got a lot of options here. We hit the jackpot. All right. Semi successful. Found a swell bottle. I think my mom's really gonna like it. I got her this like white iridescent Perfect. one and that was good. Ugg slippers are just not anywhere, so I think I'm just gonna get her the pair she wants online and then just like take a photo or be like, you're getting Uggs. Cause I know that she just doesn't like to. Sure you don't wanna check Kohl's? Yeah, yeah, I really don't think Kohl's is gonna happen. I just wanna like it. They bailed me out. They bailed you out. He like was saying how sometimes like he'll be on the hunt for something and he can't find it. Then he goes to Kohl's and they have it. Have you gone this year? No. Oh. So yeah, we're gonna go to Dick's. I'm also feeling like a little Chipotle lunch situation. Could be yummy. Shout out my dad for being my Instagram photographer. Follow me, at Danielle Carolyn. <laughs> All right, now we are heading into Dick's Sporting Goods. We can be together for a little bit, but then we have to be apart from each other. Is that cool with you? That's cool. <laughs> In the golf section, I love this shirt for Freddie. Very nice. All right, just finished at Dick's. Found some good stuff. I'll show you guys later. Walking to Chipotle now. I'm craving it. Oh, it's so good. <laughs> what a gentleman carrying my Chipotle for me. Back now. My Chipotle order is brown rice, chicken, black beans, lettuce, and pico de gallo. This is absolutely iconic. <laughs> Merry Christmas from our corn team to yours. This yeah, this is um all my YouTube friends. They did a little oh, quarantine really? photo really shoot. The they all, all well, some of them are roommates, and then they're all just like really good friends. They've just but they're all like in LA. Or something. Yeah, they all live in LA. They're all YouTubers. Oh, this is so cute, you guys. Right, you guys just got back. I will show you what I got when we were shopping when I get back. Um, but we are doing a quick change. We're headed to the vet. He's gonna do his little puppy checkup. It's my little outfit. It's from Indigo go child i love it it's like the best set ever i don't know why i just like can't shake this like anxious weird mood <sighs> so i literally don't uh, it's like the weirdest feeling and this happens to me sometimes so i think when i get back i'm gonna like sit out back and just like journal and just like get all my thoughts out manifest set intentions but then also like release some things i think i just need to like write i don't know i'm just trying to be real with you guys I, <sighs> i'm like i think i'm just like so overwhelmed with like exciting things and then I like start to feel like we. I, I don't know. I have no idea. Do you guys know what I'm talking about? And not everybody has workstations. So <laughs> we're all here. Dad came along too because he's a doctor, so we like him to like ask the hard questions, you know. And we get here, and there's like a whole tent situation, and they they just took him back, and they're gonna like talk to us on the phone. It's very COVID safe. They're gonna talk to us on the phone while they're examining him, and I mean, we brought Miley here, so like we trust them obviously, and they're the sweetest people, but. It's weird. <laughs> we're all just like, all right, I guess we're, we're like, we're like, let's go to the vet. And I was like so nervous because I don't love going to doctor. I think that's maybe why I was a little anxious. I don't like going into. Well, now you don't have. Now to. I don't have to. You're so quiet back there. Yeah, I hate going to doctors. <laughs> You are one. I know, I shouldn't be like that. I think it's because ever since I had those bad dentist days, like I just don't love offices, but. but you do well now. I do well, I do fine. I yes. do great, I do healthy. So yeah, we're just waiting now. Back from the vet. He's in his little pen. He's a good boy. They said he's a beautiful boy. Um, apparently there's something out called the Christmas star. Does this happen every year? 
First time in 800 years is the Bethlehem star. All right, we need to go outside. We need to go see the star. I think we need to go see the star. All right, so everyone's out back. I see that one. Apparently there's two though, so potentially the Bethlehem star. It's really cool. We haven't seen it in 800 years, but apparently there's another one and I'm just not seeing it, so I'm not sure. But yeah, I've got the whole fam out back. Hey, bruh. Mom with the binoculars. <laughs> there she is. Will she ever see it? Oh, wait, you can go. All right, decided to come out and do what I was talking about earlier and write out my manifestations, any affirmations, and just release anything that's kind of on my mind right now and release it here in 2020. <laughs> um, I might do this like a couple nights the next few weeks, or not nights, just any time in the day. Um, so we've got a little setup here. We've got my It's Okay journal. I love this. I've been writing like so much in this. This is by my lovely friend. Katie Bellotti. It's such good quality. I absolutely love it and I've been using it a lot and then I'm gonna be using the pen that Brooke got me for Christmas. I have not even written with it yet so I'm excited to inaugurate my beautiful Mont Blanc pen. Um, it's engraved too which is sweet. And then I like to drink either kombucha or like a um, bubbling water, carbonated water or seltzer or whatever when I just want to and this isn't alcoholic or anything. It's just a polar lime seltzer that we have here. So I'm gonna play, actually I'm not gonna play music just yet. I'm just kind of right. I'm not the biggest of Shawn Mendes fans, but I do love this song, Wonder. I just finished writing down my manifestations and what I'm letting go of this year and everything. And listen to that song and it's definitely very therapeutic. All right, so I wanna show you guys what I got today. Um, so this is for my mom. I just think this is the most beautiful swell bottle. It's like she loves white and I feel like this one's really cool because it like reflects colors and it's the larger one which is the one she wanted. Oh and then I'm so excited. So at Dick's Sporting Goods I got Freddy <laughs> I got him this hat in case we named the dog Costa. Um, either way, he loves Costa and he loves wearing hats. And I honestly love these hats on guys. So I got him a new hat because they get messed up really easily. I got my dad. He loves these like Nike dry fit shirts to work out in. And just like he goes for walks and stuff. And I liked this like light green color. So I got him that. And then you guys saw this. I got Freddie the... um golf shirt and then what I'm most excited about is I wasn't gonna do this I didn't think of it but when we got there they had all these new Bucks jerseys behind the counter and my dad has become quite the Tom Brady fan since he's moved to the Bucks my dad's been a Bucks fan for years even when they were bad um and I just thought this was a really cool thing because Tom Brady's now on the Bucks this is like a really nice stitched jersey and I think he's gonna be really surprised and he can wear this every Sunday because Freddie has one already and Freddie has a white one, so I think it'd be cool. My dad wears his red jersey, Freddie wears his white. They watch the game together, and dads are so hard to shop for, so I feel like he's really gonna like this. We just, it's actually been like a couple hours, my bad. We ordered pizza. It's just been like such a cozy night with the fam, honestly. We ordered pizza, and then we watched um, The Four Christmases. It's with Vince Vaughn and Reese Witherspoon. It's so funny. They like go to four different households on Christmas because they both have divorced parents. And we played with the puppy and took him out lots, and then, um, Santa Claus 3 is on right now because we wanted to watch like Santa Claus 1, Santa Claus 2, but they're only on Disney Plus and I don't know how to get Disney Plus on Apple TV. If you guys know, please let me know. Um, yeah, I'm just bad with TVs. I don't know about you guys, like I am so good at tech and like phones and computers, but TVs and cars, forget about it. Like I just, I just can't. So did that. You're not obviously, but I just still wanted to make sure I showed you guys what I got for Christmas for the fam. I think I am officially done shopping um i really didn't do a lot of shopping beforehand because i was busy with finals yeah i mean there's no excuse really but it was definitely a nice little day there was definitely bumps in the road i just had weird moods i don't really like going to doctors i don't like going i don't know i feel like some people are like that let's let's chat really quick i feel like it's totally normal um i just like hate being in a weird mood like i've honestly been in such a good mood and it's like why am I so anxious? Like I have a new puppy, like it's the holiday season, but I like posted a thing on my Instagram story today. Cause I just wanted to like see what was up. And I was just like, 
Does anyone else feel in like a funky mood? They don't even know why and it's just it sucks and so many people responded and were like literally same I think it does have to do with that Christmas star I was showing you guys earlier. It's the conjunction. So it's the conjunction between um, Jupiter and Saturn. They're like aligned right now. So there's just like a lot like I posted. Where's my phone? I saw this thing online and it kind of just all made sense and I mean you know everyone believes in their own things but i think this is very very interesting so this is the great conjunction on december 21st 2020 a rare alignment between jupiter and saturn is happening also known as a great conjunction in astrology a conjunction is formed when two or more planets line up exactly causing their vibrations to blend and work together the great conjunction is also happening at zero degrees which signifies a completely new beginning this means that as a society we get a fresh start and a chance to rethink our approach to freedom equality and how we can can come together to create a spark that will provide light to guide us into the future. I mean, that is reassuring right there. And then I like clicked on it. So this is on the Mayfair group. I always love the their posts and stuff. And they talked about for the earth signs. I'm an earth sign. I'm a Virgo. Um, it actually says just the thing you, you earth signs want to hear. This conjunction will push your career forward. This may manifest in a raise or a position change. Either way, prepare to be elevated within your industry, which is kind of exciting because I feel like I've just been kind of like down on myself with like social media and everything. Like after taking my break, obviously, like I was just comparing myself to everyone and I like was trying to like get my feet again and Obviously, I've been doing this for years, but I literally had never taken a break from social media ever. So I think coming back, I'm just like, it was just like a interesting transition for me, I guess. And I kind of get down on myself and compare myself to other YouTubers. And it's just, comparison is definitely the thief of joy. So I'm just like, so many emotions. But yeah, like everything's fine. Everything's good. I'm so excited about our new puppy. We still haven't named it. Um, but I am really, really thankful. And I think the holidays, it's like there's so much pressure to be so excited and so festive and i love the holidays they put me in the best mood but then there's also a lot of emotions that come with it because the family's back together most of the time and i'm obviously so thankful that i get to be with my family right now but things come up you know emotions come up and i'm just someone like if i feel emotions like i want to feel them like i want to let them out whether that's writing them talking to someone about it like i don't like to keep them in and i think the last few days i've not the last few days a little bit last night and today i was just like keeping in my emotions which is just bleh danielle we don't push those emotions down some people do and no judge like i understand everyone handles things differently but for me i'm like hey here are my problems which is bad and good at the same time but i think that's why i've stayed so you know i've had my times but i've stayed pretty like good because i you know i'll have a rough patch and i'll want to talk about it and i'll talk about it and then i'm like good i get over it and then i have a new you know challenge that i deal with but i think talking about it is so important and whether that's with a therapist i love my therapist or whether that's talking to your mom talking to your brother talking to a friend writing it down in a journal whatever it is it just helps to just get it out of you and just onto something else and out out just away release it i love the phrase of like releasing it and setting intentions for the new year and everything like that yeah i definitely am starting to feel a little bit lighter a little bit less stressed i think that that's just normal and i i just i like to be happy all the time and i am happy a lot of the time so i think when i'm not happy i'm like what's going on I'm like what you know but it, that's just being in tune with your emotions and being in tune with yourself and i'm not happy all the time should i say but like <sighs> But yeah, these next few weeks, it's just so nice to be home and not worrying about school and just do my thing. So yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying the Vlogmas. I so many comments like, I'm so sad Vlogmas is about to end. Um, and I am too. But I think it'll also be a really good time. I think I'm going to take a break, not from social media, but from vlogging from like, you know, like a little after Christmas to New Year's just so I can have like... I can come back in the new year and just be like, yo, what's up? Like, let's get it, 2021. Um, and I just want to like spend time with the puppy because I'm not bringing him back to college, I don't think, at least not right away. And I only have one more semester at school and I live in an apartment. Um, and I mean, that's not to say I could totally see myself like taking care of him, you know, in the future or like, you know, whatever it may be because it's definitely our family's dog, but I would rather him just like grow up here in a house. I'm just gonna miss him a lot. We'll have to have lots of FaceTimes. He's this the thing, like I'm so happy I get to be with him in his puppy stages, but literally the next time I see him, it's gonna be huge or just a lot bigger than he is now. So that's kind of how I'm feeling. And I think it's good to just sit down and get in tune with your feelings sometimes. And I'm doing it for half a million people. So hey, what's up guys? But I love you all so much. I hope you enjoyed. I. Um, I think I'm gonna do a little reading tonight on the Kindle. Crate training night three. 
he's been really good he falls asleep he just wakes up in the morning so crossing my fingers for that i feel like literally i have a newborn it's so funny but everyone's been loving the pup and hopefully we'll have a name soon <laughs> and but it makes me feel better so, like margo margo lee texted me and she was like dude literally we took three weeks to name rue so i was like okay that makes me feel better so we just wanted to be perfect you know and anyways i love you guys so much stay tuned for tomorrow's video i'll see you guys i'll see you guys tomorrow <laughs> bye